just in short, uh, tell us about your time here in Bunawayo, which comes. How is it been like? No, um, I was greatly surprised in the set of the country. Uh, it's truly a correctional facility. This is not a prison. Uh, when you compare with uh, Chikurubi and other places, I think this is the blueprint that you have to use. And, um, um, you know, everyone has really been professional. And if you notice even the health of the prisoners, the mental health, the wellness, the programs that they have here, um, five star. Um, yeah. you, you basically, you are what we call uh, a high profile prison. Yes. In the sense that we are celebrating. Yes. Uh, it's you know what's actually surprising about this place there's a brotherhood that's there everyone is treated the same so this whole issue of like yeah you might have a name out there but when you're in here you're a human being just like any other person you are treated the same way the rights that you have are exactly the same and I wouldn't take away anything yeah how does Mr. Mkubi keep his Busy. Okay, um, you know at this prison you've got educational facilities, so I've got people that I'm already helping in terms of, as you know I'm a math fundi, uh, I'm a finance fundi, I've got people that I'm already teaching commerce, I've got people that I'm teaching mathematics, um, and then also you know everyone aspires to be an entrepreneur, so you'll find people come to you and ask you in terms of like finance, entrepreneurship, what is it that I can be able to do? And I impart those world skills that I have. So whichever way I can be able to help, I help out. Okay. Yes. And uh, maybe last but not least, uh, what's word of advice to people out there in terms of uh, trying to live a life that is crime-free? If I can put that way. No, I, I think what I've seen out here, uh, this is not a place that you wish anyone to be. Um, it's always proper and right to be just on the right side of the road and just read the straightforward life. And at the end of the day, the biggest advice that I'll give anyone is stay true to God. Okay. Okay. Yes. How important is family support when you're in a situation where you are serving time in prison? Um, family is everything. You know, I have I have some brothers here who've gone for eight years without a visitor. You can tell that it affects you mentally. And I would really urge people out there, if you've got someone who's in prison, no matter what crime is committed, please take time to visit people. Because your rehabilitation starts with family accepting you. If you're going to come out of prison, who are you going to come out to? So I would really call out to family out there, please don't forget these guys who are out of prison. You know, I've got my grandmother, 86 years old, who's come to visit me all the way from Harare. You can imagine what that does to me. It, it, it makes me feel that I'm still human. I've got people that still love me. Where is the uh, date of release? Or the, it is the year? I'm not sure. Um, I've got a reserved judgment. Okay. So I'm still waiting for my judgment to come out. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time.